Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. This is Rashmi. So today I'm here with a blackhead removal hack. It's a very easy thing to do and I have tried it in the past. It works and today I want to show it to you because it's so easy to do and uh, usually we use those pore strips and we're trying other methods of removing blackheads, especially my hubby. He has a lot of blackheads on his nose and he uses those pore strips and whatnot. But this hack is so simple and we have all the stuff at home uh, from the bathroom and it's like a 10 minute process. So let me show you what to do. But before we begin the video, please do not forget to like this video and subscribe to my channel. So for this, the main thing that we need is Vaseline or petroleum jelly. So I'm sure that we all have this in our house. We use it, you know, on the lips or on the skin, whatever. So we need this and we need some cling wrap. So unfortunately, when I need the cling wrap the most, I'm out of it. So I'm just using this other kind of wrap. This is a, this is the saran wrap, I believe it's called. It's a different kind of a wrap. It, it's sticky on the inside, but it doesn't have any stickiness on the other side. So I just folded up a piece of it and we need this. And we need a couple of Q-tips. And then in the end of the video, I'll show you one trick that no one has ever showed you how to extract the blackheads with a bathroom tool. Very easy. So keep on watching and I'll show you that. And uh, before we begin, I want to let you know that my skin is clean. It's washed. I have nothing on my face. I have no lotion, moisturizer, skincare, nothing. I just washed it with uh, face wash and I dried it up and it's nice and clean. No makeup, nothing. So let's begin. So first thing we're going to do is we're going to grab some Vaseline on a Q-tip or you can use your fingers. It doesn't really matter. We're just going to grab a bunch of it. And we're going to put it on the nose. Just apply it. Okay, lately I've been wearing a lot of makeup. So I, I'm seeing like a like some big blackheads. Like I, I can feel one like right here. So I'm going to try to extract that one. I do have some like up here on my cheek where I had this big pimple. But I'm not going to bother with that one today. I'm just going to do the nose area and my uh, cheek area. So we're just going to apply a bunch of Vaseline. And I'm just going to use my finger to spread it evenly because the Q-tip is not going to do the job. And my nose is also pretty rough. Um, I haven't exfoliated it in over a week. And I have been wearing a lot of makeup. So, you know, when you wear makeup, you, your pores get clogged and you start seeing blackheads. I do keep my skin very clean. I mean, I do a lot of things to my skin, but exfoliation is very very necessary so i've applied this all over wherever i want to remove my blackheads and next thing we're going to do is we'll take the wrap now if it's it's preferable if you have the cling wrap because it's going to stick better to your skin but since i don't have it i'm just going to use this one and if you don't have it either just use any plastic you can even just chop up like a plastic bag and use it and then just obviously leave some space for breathing so it sticks pretty well i was not sure if this would do the job but it sticks pretty well so we put this on so i'm sorry that i look really obnoxious at the moment but we gotta do this so i have a clean towel okay and i have some very hot water in here can you see the steam coming out I'm not sure if you can see it, but this is like hot, hot water, okay? So we're just gonna dip the towel in there. I'm just like dipping the towel in the hot water. I'm trying to be careful not to burn myself and I'm sitting on my bed. So I don't wanna like spill any water and make a mess. And this is like super hot. So I'm not even able to touch it. Oh. I mean, it's really simple, you can just Stand in your bathroom and pretty much do this. Okay, so hot towel. And we're just gonna put this hot towel on onto the plastic. And we're gonna leave this on for 10 minutes. Okay, we'll just we'll just steam our face for 10 minutes to make the skin soft and make the pores open.
Okay, guys. <clears throat> so the 10 minutes are now up. And we're done steaming our face. So we'll just remove this. And <clears throat> you can see that my nose is a little red because of the heat. Next thing we'll do is we'll take that Q-tip which we used earlier because it's clean. And we're going to just like basically just kind of go over the skin with it. And try to, you know, peel the skin off because it's soft right now. So the dead skin and some of the white heads, some of the black heads, they will come off. I'm taking another Q-tip and I'm going over it one more time. Just trying to kind of, you know, rub the skin. Next thing I'll do is, I'll take some oil. You can go with any oil. I'm using Moroccan Argan Oil from My Glam USA, which is my brand. And you can find this on my website. So I'm just taking some Argan Oil. You can take any kind of oil that you like. Coconut, um, coconut oil or um, olive oil, whatever. Anything is fine. Just taking some oil and I'm rubbing it on my skin. Basically, this oil will do some cleansing for me and any pore blockage that the Vaseline is going to cause is going to be stopped by this oil cleansing. So I'm just rubbing the oil into my skin for about one minute and then I'm going to take a tissue. I'm not taking the soft tissue which we use to blow our nose with because those tissues have fiber on them and I don't want the fiber sticking to my skin so I'm taking a kitchen tissue like a kitchen paper towel okay and I'm I'm just gonna wipe my skin with that can you see I can see it and I can feel it my nose is like already so soft because all the dead skin just came off and also rubbing with this tissue is exfoliating it's giving me an exfoliation action okay so we are done with all the other steps now the final step to remove those big blackheads or the ones that are still left over in the skin so the magic trick easy and simple Ta-da! it's a bobby pin okay right there bobby pin you can use the blackhead removal tool if you have it the one that has like a circle in it but since i don't have it and i've always been using this so i'm going to use this okay bobby pin because it has that shape right there which i need so i'm just gonna go over my nose like this and since i'm not in front of a mirror i'm not able to clearly see what i'm doing but um it's better if you stand in front of a like a, a magnifying mirror and do this so you can see what you're actually doing so i i don't really have that many blackheads on my nose so i'm not being very precise about it so basically i'm just showing you guys but if you have any blackheads left over, this is what you would do. Just go with the bobby pin like this. And especially where you see the blackheads, kind of press a little harder and they should come right out. And uh, some of the gunk has come out and I don't want to show you guys and gross you out, but I can see the gunk stuck inside the circle. Let me just clean it real quick. I'm just cleaning it up. Okay. And on this side. This is, guys, guys, this is the easiest way to remove the blackheads. Even if you just steam your face and do this, or after a hot shower, when you come out of the hot shower, you can do this and your blackheads will come right off. Very, very easy to do. You can see how I'm pressing my skin. So you have to use a little bit of pressure okay and that's done and then for this big one which i have been where is it it's on this side you know what i feel like it's gone already i can't feel it anymore I'm just gonna go over my skin a little bit
be careful do not go very hard because you don't want to scratch your skin and you know hurt yourself you don't want to like injure yourself just use a little bit of pressure so the gunk comes out but don't hurt yourself i've done that before So guys, I went to the bathroom and I looked in the big mirror and I actually saw that blackhead which was there. It was tiny but I got it out and I have it right here. <laughs> it came out and you can see my skin is a little more red over there because I had to kind of, you know, apply a little more pressure and get it out but it came right out easily. So that is it. We are done removing our blackheads. Super easy and simple. I hope you guys like this video. Do not forget to hit that thumbs up button and uh, subscribe to my channel and please do comment down below and let me know um, if you have any questions and in future what would you like for me to make what kind of videos any topics any specific uh, problems or um, issues you have if you would like me to address those please let me know and until next time i'll see you again Bye bye